Good morning, everyone, and welcome to another Monday Coffee Break. We have another assortment of coffees from Bones Coffee Co. These are their like Christmas flavors, so I thought this would be uh, be really cool to try out a couple of these over the next month or so, and uh, and see what they taste like. So let's go ahead and look. We have white chocolate peppermint bark. I do like peppermint, um, but it can be really overdone. Again, great artwork on these. So that should be interesting. I recently had a, um, a cold brew. It was something with, with mint in it. And I, maybe that was Keto Crate. Anyway, I just remember it being ridiculously minty. Next up, we have eggnog. I personally love... Look at that artwork. It's great, isn't it? <laughs> I personally love eggnog. Uh, I actually bought a carton of it here recently, and uh, I've been drinking on that, so I enjoy eggnog. Be interesting what it's like in a coffee form, though. We have Gingerbread Man. <laughs> so, uh, kind of, I, I guess, a I don't know, a gingerbread would be interesting, but I think that that would remind me a little bit of like a fall coffee, perhaps. We have uh, jingle, <laughs> jingle Bones, Coconut, Caramel, and Vanilla. So it's kind of taking, I mean, <sighs> it's taking a lot of flavors here that are very common in most coffees, like Caramel, Vanilla, um, you know, you can hear, here's a, you know, caramel latte, here's a caramel, whatever, or a vanilla, you know, French vanilla, something. Uh, oh yeah, coconut, let's do it. So I don't know, this should be interesting. I'm not quite sure what will be the prevailing flavor, but you know, it, it sounds interesting. And then perhaps the most colorful, oh fudge. So maybe some chocolatey fudgy goodness going in there. Again, great artwork. Name that movie. <laughs> so, um, man, I have been, I've actually been struggling with which one I wanted to try first. Uh, but I gotta say, I think O oh Fudge is gonna take it. I was, I was leaning towards eggnog, but we'll get there. So we're gonna go ahead and try O oh Fudge today, see what that tastes like. Let's open it up and, and give it a nice smell. Oh, okay. Hmm. What does that remind me of? It reminds me of a cereal. I just can't think of what it is. I just keep, you know, in and out. I don't know. It smells like a cereal. Uh, it should be interesting. So we're going to go ahead and get O Fudge working, and then we will be right back with some tasting. Our coffee is brewed and very interesting the coffee. It, 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 had, um, it had a head to it. You, know, you pour a beer, you get the head. Um, very interesting. It's most, most of the coffees, uh, it's nothing. You know, you get a little bit of fizz and, and that's it. But this actually had a a bit of a head. <laughs> I don't know what that's up. What the, what's up with that? Uh, but anyway, smells good. Hopefully, it is good. Let's go ahead and pour ourselves a cup and see what O oh Fudge from Doctor Bones. I always call them Doctor Bones. They're not. It's Bones Coffee Company. It's Doctor Bean. Doctor Bean Bones Coffee. Two different companies. <laughs> But, well, let's see what uh, Bones Coffee Co. tastes like. I'm still trying to figure out what that smell is, because it's almost like, like corn pop cereal or something like that. I don't know. This is probably going to burn my face off. Give it a couple blows. Don't want to burn my tongue. <laughs> Yeah, it's a little warm. <clears throat> a little warm. Hmm. 
that's that's an interesting flavor. Um, bit struggled because uh, it is so darn hot. Um, <clears throat> let's see. You know, kind of medium bodied. Not a ton of distinguishable notes, honestly. I guess I kind of figured <clears throat> there'd be some chocolate notes. And there might be a little bit. Maybe this is one that requires more <clears throat> you know, more ground in the mix. Maybe I should have made it a little stronger, perhaps. <clears throat> but yeah, it, it's... I'm probably entirely wrong on this, but it, I'm just going by what, what I'm... what I'm tasting or what I'm smelling. I don't know if it's the smell that's causing the taste buds to do what they're doing, but there's some interesting, like, corn wheat, corn, sort of smell, taste, taste, smell. I mean, it's, 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 it's kind of like, um, yeah, I mean, okay, yeah, I could drink this coffee, but I don't necessarily think I would overthink it very much. You know, if you said, hey, drink this coffee, and what do you, what do you think of it? Say, yeah, it's good. It's, it's good. Oh, well, it's a Christmas or a holiday selection from so-and-so. It's a so fudge. Oh, okay. Um, sure. I mean, <clears throat> yeah, it just doesn't really remind me of fudge. I like fudge. Perhaps, though, this is one that needs to be made a little stronger uh, than what I normally make it. And, I mean, I made it a little bit stronger than even what I normally do. Um, but, you know, it, it, just as it sits, you know, it's got a nice smell to it. Uh, you know what? It's fairly reminiscent of the French toast. The, I think I've put that one up. Pretty sure I did that. Yeah, I did. It is fairly reminiscent of the smell from the French toast. But yeah, taste-wise, it's, it's smooth. It's not bitter. <clears throat> Um, yeah, it's just a nice, you know, smoothish coffee with like a, a very hinty hint of, of chocolate on the end. I don't know. It's, it, the more you drink it, it is very pleasing. Like I kind of almost want to put some Bailey's in this or, or something like that. <clears throat> I think I'd really enjoy that. Just put a little Bailey's in here and, uh, you know, have a nice warm, strong cup of coffee. But I would say that this is definitely one that I feel like you, you really have to put the grounds in. Like you, you really need to make it nice and strong. Um, because if you don't, you might be a little bit underwhelmed by the flavor. So, and as someone who is not necessarily like a, uh, <clears throat> you know, I'm going to put the entire bag of grounds in there. This could probably use a little bit more than what I normally do. For sure. But it's not bad. It's good drinking coffee. Um, I'm excited to see the rest of the range. Uh, see what Bones does. Great artwork. Interesting flavor combinations. So check them out. I'll put the link below in the description so you can uh, check out their website. Uh, but anyway, hopefully you guys have a great morning. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And we will catch you on the next one. See ya.